Morning. Have you ever wanted to grow giant bamboo? In this video, I'm going to talk about how I was able to sprout those dormant Mosa bamboo seeds that you might see on Amazon. I know I tried them once and they didn't do it right. Second time around, I did a different strategy. and I'm going to talk about that in, the, that in this video so you can do it yourself. So this is the plastic bag paper towel method. And I just put a bunch of seeds in the plastic bag. Um, as you can see, I have a sprouted one here. And then picking through these seeds, I put about 30 seeds in one bag and 20 in the other. And of these 30, um, looks like I'm gonna, that's two. I don't know if you can see the little root coming out of there. But a few of them are starting to sprout. So I did a quick glance through here and I have five that have sprouted out of these 30. So it's not a huge yield. You know, slightly more than 10 percent you know 15 percent or so so it's a very low germination rate at least from my experience so i'm gonna tell you about my strategy so what i did is i put the seeds in a moist but not sopping wet paper towel and then put that in a plastic bag and then i put it in the bottom of my fridge for a week and i actually did this with two bags one of the one of them i didn't put in my fridge the other one i did put in my fridge and after a week I took it out, the other one I left out of the fridge, and the one I never put in the fridge never had any germination, zero germination. But the one I put in the fridge for a week and then took out, I, you know, I, like I just said, I had about 15% germination. So I think the seeds are dormant, and for whatever reason, putting them in the refrigerator for a week breaks that dormancy and gets some of them to sprout. So if you haven't had any luck with this, try putting them in the fridge for a week first, and you might get a little bit better luck. So hope that helps you. And then once they get a little embryonic root, once they get going a little bit, I just put them in some soil. As you can see here, I'm gonna cover up the little root, let that little um, start point up, and then you know, I'll do an update in a couple weeks or something to see how this does. And I'm probably gonna put a bag over the top of this to keep it from drying out, because I don't wanna water it too much. I'm gonna keep it just slightly moist I don't want it to be sopping wet. So plastic bag will keep that water from leaving until it gets a decent root system that can support the transpiration water loss. So I hope this helps you to grow this stuff, at least to get them to sprout.